Welcome to London, Wilbur Ross. You might not have noticed that the US Commerce Secretary is in the UK, forgivable since he looks more like a funeral parlor director than an international statesman. But he has been sloping around town since at least last Thursday. Last week, the US Embassy in London posted photographs of Ross with Foreign Secretary Boris Johnson and Business Secretary Greg Clark to discuss UK US trade. There was no sign of Liam Fox, our international trade secretary, who met him previously. This afternoon, Ross is booked to speak at the CBI, on the same billing as Theresa May this morning. And in the interim he has been staying at the U.S. Ambassador's residence, Winfield House in Regent's Park, and motoring around in a Chevy Suburban SUV. Ross has finally garnered some headlines in the British newspapers today, as one of the key figures named in the Paradise Papers for previously unknown investments. So how did the Brits find meeting their counterpart? Were the talks productive? Have we bounced ourselves to the front of the queue? Jolly! Jolly, Jolly was Boris's reaction on Twitter after the meeting, as he praised the US-UK trade deal and the exciting opportunities it will present. The Foreign Office hasn't responded to our request for further reaction today.